This corner store is a small oasis in one of Washington's food deserts. It tastes real good. Bad mm -hmm. With some chips. Yeah, the onion's good for you. Yeah. And the mm, I want to know. Miles from a grocery store, this is the only local shop where people can buy fresh food. And you can purchase any of these items inside of the store. The garlic, the tomatoes, the green peppers. But this is a nationwide issue. 23 and a half million Americans live in food deserts, according to the United States Department of Agriculture. The Healthy Corners initiative allows shops to buy small amounts of produce at wholesale prices, meaning they can afford to stock the items and people without easy access to big stores can still eat well. Just one way the DC Food Policy Council is trying to end food deserts. There is indeed a lot of hunger in the United States, in the nation's capital. I like to say the capital of the most powerful country in the known universe. That is reprehensible. This is about poverty. I don't know very many rich people that are hungry. So we will have people having less food hardships and food insecurity when we have fair wages, good jobs, good education. This is one of just three full-service grocery stores here on the eastern edge of Washington. But in the more affluent northwest part of the city, residents have eight to choose from. There's three full-service grocery stores that feed 149,000. It's despicable, actually. I think it's very difficult for the whole entire black community to have access to healthy, live, non-GMO foods at a reasonable price. But supermarket chain Safeway says it has no plans to open additional stores in the city. Instead, many residents will have to rely on schemes like this for convenient, healthy options. I think it's good. I think it's real good because look at me. I used to weigh 180. Now I'm good if I weigh 120. The demand for this neighborhood is really what has driven our need to provide larger refrigeration units for the products that we're selling. Uh, last year alone, we sold over 200,000 units um, just in Ward 7 and 8, um, which is pretty significant. And 100% of our now 74 corner store owners reported an increase in their profits as a result of selling Healthy Corners items. The city's administration says it recognizes the importance of fresh food offerings and is working to improve food access. But that's little comfort to those who have to travel from far and wide to get their fresh produce, making schemes like this one even more vital to the health of the city and to the country. Kate Fisher, CGTN, Washington.